President Joe Biden often refers to himself as the kid from Scranton, and those who live on the same street where he grew up have mixed feelings about him bowing out of the race. Newswatch 16's Melissa Steininger spoke to voters in the Electric City who say they were surprised by the president's decision. A plaque marks President Joe Biden's childhood home on North Washington Avenue in Scranton. A little piece of history Jim Wasmuth just so happened to miss when he moved in a few houses down. The thing is, I did not know that I was moving into the neighborhood where Joe Biden grew up, the Scranton scrapper. So Biden's first visit back home came as quite a surprise, as did the news on Sunday. I'm really surprised. I, I really thought that Joe Biden was going to stick it out. Politics is politics, but... I, I just David Evans has lived on Biden Street for 40 years and has seen the president visit a number of times. While he says he's not a Biden supporter, he's sad to see him go out in this way. This is nothing more than elder abuse to what they did to him. You know, I, I, he, he's old, yes. He can still think. Is he slow? And sometimes he forget. I'm 71. I do the same thing. Maybe not as much, but he shouldn't have been forced to do what he did, in my opinion. And no matter which way neighbors vote here on President Biden's childhood street, they say his significance to Scranton will last much longer than just the four years of his presidency. It's a good thing for the city and the Democrats in the city and, you know, and the neighbors. And, you know, sometimes it gets hectic, but uh, it is what it is. As they're uncertain of where exactly things will stand come November. Well, no, I'd like to see him stay. I wish he would have stayed. He, he had a chance, you know, that party would have a chance of winning. I don't know that they have one now. I don't see how the uh, the Democrats are going to get their their word across, and and do it in a way that is cohesive, and and just plain blunt. Melissa Steininger, Newswatch 16, Scranton.